In this short video, I'm going to show you how to change touch and hold delay on Android. To record this video, I'm using a Samsung S23 Plus, so please keep that in mind as the process for what I'm about to show you might look a little bit different depending on the type of Android device that you have. So when it comes to the touch and hold delay, what that basically means is how quickly your mobile device reacts to any touch and hold command. So for example, if I want to move this camera application right here, um, up here, for example, I need to touch and hold on top of the application in order to select it and then be able to move it. So let me show you how long that takes right now. As you can see, it takes about half a second for me, um, for my phone to react. So if you want to reduce that time or increase it depending on your needs, what you need to do is head over to your settings and then I want you to scroll all the way to the bottom of the page and then click on accessibility, which is right here. Tap on that. Then look for interaction and dexterity, which is right here. Click on that. And then right beneath touch sensitivity, which is right here, um, click on touch and hold delay. As you can see, mine is currently set to 0 0.62 seconds. So uh, from the top side here, in my particular case, I can choose from one of the presets, which is very short, short, medium and long, or I can also customize it. So if I just click on custom, for example, I can basically hold. And for as long as I hold, this is how long it's going to take. So 2.99 seconds for my phone to react to any touch and hold actions. Now, if I want it to be shorter, I can just basically hold it like this and do this even uh, if you want it to be even lower. Now, please keep in mind that in, on my particular device, the lowest that I can go is 0 0.20 seconds. I cannot go any lower than that, unfortunately. Um, so yeah. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to change touch and hold delay on Android. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below and I'll do my best to help you out.